15 0. Thirteen. Let second serve. sort of shot that is so frustrating to Agassi supporters. Surely he can find something here, it's Deuce. Black really makes Agassi look slow here, certainly to recover, and has any number of choices there to win the point. Advantage Agassi. by six games to five, four sets. Black leads by two sets to one. And the drama mounting here. At the moment, Agassi is just trying to cling on, trying to hit his shots, making too many errors. Flack, well, he is desperately trying to hit the ball on his returns as well, like he did so often, but can't quite free his arm to do it. He's choking a little, and that's totally understandable. But what a marvellous situation he's in now. Yes, well, he's got, of course, to hold his serve to get him to the tie-break. And then, of course, I think his chances, obviously, are, are the best because anything can happen. But you sense as this set progresses, and in, we started to see it really in the beginning of the set, having secured the break of serve, he lost his own serve. That It was going to be quite a Herculean Hi. task for him to close the match out. So difficult for the underdog in this situation. Huge interest in this match now, of course, with the prospect of an upset. But we're a long way from that yet. Thank you. Five, six. Fifteen luck. Waiting for the call of let, but never came. Well, no, Rudy Berger didn't hear it.
30 low. Game flat. Exactly how he won his serve in the eighth game with an ace on the game point down the middle. That's his 20th today. Well, anything can happen in a tie-break. And more and more, this match, just like the match Agassi played against Etlis. Gaston Etlis in the first round of the Australian Agassi Open. That had a tie-break to end the full set. Well, this really is, under the circumstances, a wonderful return from within the body, cross-court. It's an in initial mini-break. Two-zero play. Time and again, that has been the place he's delivered his aces. 21 now. in this rally. Look at the forehand he unleashes here from a deep ball. Two all. Three, two, Agassi. Thank you. Three all. All that remains here is to know whether Clack really believes he can beat a player like Agassi. Or whether this man's reputation will carry him through this. Difficult tie break and into a fifth set. Three all. He was moving to the forehand as Agassi played his forehand and was able to find the passing shot. Thank you. Four. 
Thank you. Great play. The serve was too short. Black spotted it. Five, four, and then he came. Three. Here he is. Beautiful guided volley. That's all it needed. Two points between Flack and a place in the history books. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. because the cry of out by the lineswoman had not been heard because of the noise from the crowd. Thank you. Five all. Six five flag. Well, an extraordinary rally that was. Doubt about the ball at this end of the court, but no doubt about that half volley winner. It's match point to flank. Thank you. Oh, drama piles on drama. It was a let. Nobody hears it, of course, now, because you, you don't have the let court oh. judge calling That's it out. It. Only the umpire hears the device. through there as his arm refused to function normally and carted the ball down into the net. He'd hit so many brilliant winners from that same position against second serves. Thank you. But it's six all. <gasps> and there was one. Seven, six. Well, no stiffness in his forearm there. That's one of the shots, the best shots that he's played in the entire match. Gives him a second match point. Thank you. Quiet, please. He's done it! Game seven match play. Two, six, seven, six, six, four, seven, six. Just making gestures of delight to his friends among the players at court side opposite him. The ball goes into the crowd, who are stunned with disbelief that this man, who they come to see triumph, is out at the first hurdle, just as he was the first time he came here back in 1987, when he lost to Henri Leconte. Since then, he's done wonders from the back of the court, winning the title in 1992. But he came here under tennis, un under prepared, under trained, and sadly carrying an infection, a chest infection for which he's receiving treatment but nicely waiting for his conqueror, Doug Flack. All credit to him. When it mattered, he came through with a serve on match point to clinch what surely will be the upset of these championships.